Welcome back to 7 News at 6. It is the first of its kind in South Carolina and one of only five in the country. A school dedicated to teaching children with dyslexia is now opening in Pickens County. 7 News' Nicole Ford got an inside look to how this school is changing the landscape of education for students with disabilities. Inside Crosswell Elementary, two school districts are sharing one building in order to educate the future generations. I've always known that Lucy was very smart and very creative and had so much potential. It was just a matter of how do we tap into that. Elizabeth Maxson enrolled her daughter in Lakes and Bridges Charter School when they opened inside this Pickens County Elementary School this year. Like each one of the kids gets individualized attention and education based on exactly what they need. And as a mom, that's huge. Each of the 112 students enrolled in this public charter school has dyslexia. We have students who have moved from Charleston. We have students who have moved from Columbia. We have families from Georgia, from Indiana, from New York who have made the move specifically for this school. A learning disability that affects 15 to 20 percent of all students. A disability that will be screened for in all South Carolina public schools starting next year. It's important to make sure their needs are being met because these are the kids that are the innovators. They are the ones who are going to push us forward. This charter school is state funded and tuition free to their students. And the demand is there with wait lists for almost every one of their grade levels. We will add one grade per year till we end up being a kindergarten through eighth grade school. So next year we'll add sixth grade, the following year seventh. So our students who are with us as fifth graders will move all the way up to eighth grade. In Pickens County, Nicole Fort, 7 News.